Hello everyone, what's up? Welcome back to my channel and to anyone that is new here. Hi, my name is Christy. I'm a personal stylist that helps women rise through style. Now today, I wanted to talk to all of you about how to elevate your basics. You hear about the wardrobe basic thing all the time at nauseam, probably on YouTube across the board and from anyone that talks about style. And there's reason for it. These are the foundational glue to your closet. But I wanted to talk, spend some time with you guys today and show you how you might be able to elevate your simple basics in your closet so you don't necessarily need the trendy items because not everybody wants to go in that direction, but you can still get a lot of use and wear and still have your outfits look beautiful and modern with just elevating your basics. And if any of you aren't sure what your wardrobe basics are, I also have a free guide or a free checklist with wardrobe basics that you can get when you sign up for my VIP list. So I will leave the link for my website down below and you guys can have that sent directly to your inbox. Now, the first way to elevate your basics is to pay attention to cut. Fit is king when it comes to your clothing and you really wanna pay attention to what really flatters your shape. Now, the reason I talk about cut so much is because when you get something that really looks like it fits your body like a glove, it just makes everything look so much more elevated and expensive when it comes to your outfit. So even if you're buying you know, a $30 pair of jeans, if it fits you really, really well, it's going to look so beautiful on your body, which not only is gonna make you feel good, but it just elevates the whole outfit overall because it really, really flatters your shape. So as an example of this, I've got a really beautiful pair of high-rise uh, black flare jeans, which are one of my favorites in terms of like just a basic in your wardrobe. They also work really well for my body type. So if you aren't sure what kind of jean or rise for a pant works well for your shape, I'll leave my video on how to find your perfect denim down below for you guys so you can check that out. But you know, the cut of all of these pieces is really what makes this whole outfit look elevated. The, the flares fit me really well. They fit well along my hip line, along my legs. And then I've got just something as simple as a blazer, which is also a great wardrobe essential. And again, the cut of this blazer just looks so fantastic. So it really elevates the outfit overall. Bonus that it's in a splash of color too. So if you wanna get a splash of color, this also is helpful for your basics. But again, it's the cut, it's the tailoring of these pieces that elevates the outfit and makes it look more expensive. So never ever underestimate the power of a good cut for your body. It's such a game changer. Now to give an example of the power of cut, I also wanna show you guys quickly another version of the same outfit, just with a different blazer that doesn't have any tailoring to it. And you'll be able to see from one blazer to the next with these outfits, that they look completely different. The one that has a better cut, that has better tailoring to it, that outfit looks more expensive, and the one that has no tailoring to the jacket, so the cut's not quite as lovely, even though you can obviously go for a more relaxed style, but the cut, because it's not quite as finished looking or as tailored, you can see between the two looks, one looks more elevated and the other does not. Now, another way to elevate your basics is to play with texture. Now, this is something that's really simple but has such a massive impact in your overall outfits and aesthetic. So what I've done here is taken a wardrobe basic, which is a simple pencil skirt. And yes, I love these even if you are someone that is at home because you can, of course, dress them down with sneakers. However, what makes this skirt more interesting is it's in a pleather or leather. You guys can choose which you, whichever you prefer. And the leather just takes the basic up a notch. It makes it look a little bit more interesting. And I I love the idea of this for fall for pairing it with snuggly sweaters let's say for example or cardigans but in this case to again play more on texture as well I've also elevated my simple button-up blouse that I paired with this outfit with a nice silky uh, material so I love the silk blouse this one's actually from Lily Silk you guys have probably seen it on my channel before but again the juxtaposition between the leather and the silk looks so beautiful together this would be a great business casual outfit for the office especially when you pair it with some beautiful pumps uh, or even some nice like pointed toe flats but again it's that mix in texture that makes the outfit look more elevated and more interesting so again this is something really simple that you can do at home you could do it with you know denim and a pleather or again the sweaters that I mentioned and, and uh, like a pleather or leather. So have fun experimenting with some of the pieces that you have in your closet just based on texture alone. There's a world of possibilities and it will definitely elevate your outfit in seconds. The next way to elevate your basics is to be intentional with accessories. Really at the end of the day with style, a lot of it has to do with being intentional with small tweaks. So how are you making your outfit look like you put more thought into it than you actually did? 
kind of like the smoke and mirror effect of style. So what I've done is I've taken a very simple pair of denim and I've put it with a basic sweater. This is something that I think most of us probably do on the weekend, right? Just something easy you can throw on and go with. But what elevates this is the use of accessories. So adding a belt, adding earrings, uh, adding a nice like piece of footwear. It doesn't matter whether it's sneakers or a heel or what have you. Adding those small intentional tweaks really creates a large impact when it comes to your outfit. And again, it's something that takes seconds, but adding those intentional things with accessories instantly makes the outfit look more polished, more put together. It looks like you put more thought into your outfit, but really, like I said, took seconds to do and you instantly look more elevated as a result. Now the next way to elevate your basics is using metallics and color. This is actually one of my most simple easy hacks when it comes to adding really beautiful classics into your wardrobe. Yes of course you want them in neutrals. Neutrals have a time and place for sure in the closet but what I love once you've got those is to get some of your classics in a gorgeous shot of color or a metallic. The cut of them, that classic piece in its beautiful traditional tailoring will look beautiful and will stand the test of time. But when you're adding a shot of color, it instantly makes that piece look more interesting. So again, if we go back to the outfit that I had in the beginning with the black flare jeans, the black camisole, and we're talking about the blazer that I have on, that pop of orange that I've got is what really takes that outfit up a notch, but there's nothing about the blazer that is over the top or trendy or obnoxious that it's not going to last for seasons. Actually, that blazer I've had for almost 10 years, if not longer, and I love this piece. And it's the shot of color that keeps it current whilst still in a very, very classic silhouette. So don't underestimate the power of color and metallics. Even my gold shoes that you guys see at nauseum all the time on my channel, I mean, my God, I've had those for years and they go with absolutely everything because they are in a timeless classic pump silhouette but again, shot of color or metallic is what makes it really, really interesting. So give that a try next time you're looking for your basics. It makes all the difference. The next way to elevate your basics is to invest in a really good quality. Now I've talked about this on my channel before, but when you're getting a really good quality, not only does it make you stand taller because it makes you feel kind of special to put on something that you've really invested in for yourself. So just get the best quality that you can afford. Um, but there is a difference in the stitching, the cut, the fabric that goes into it. There's just a better quality overall. And those pieces do look more elevated when you are putting together an outfit. Now that doesn't mean that you have to have a whole outfit that's expensive from head to toe. This is why I love mixing and matching, you know, Louboutin flats with Walmart jeans, let's say for example, there's space for everything, but it's about finding things that you really love and investing in the things that are important to you when it comes to your personal style, because that investment, that quality, can really help elevate some of those, you know, trendier, fun pieces in your closet and take the whole image overall up a notch. And if any of you aren't sure about what cuts work for your body type and you want a little bit more information about this, I do have a full online class that is three hours plus a really detailed workbook teaching you all about how to find your body shape and how to dress it right down to fabrics and cuts. So I'll leave the information for that down below. And if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, hit the little red subscribe button down below so you don't miss any future videos from me. And other than that, my angels, I'm sending you all the love to the moon and back and I'll see you again in the next video. Bye guys.